So this is our first stop of the day. We're going to Lanakai Beach, supposed to be top beach destination here in Oahu. All right, y'all, so we made it to Lanakai Beach. Apparently, this is the beach to be for nice views because it's not as crowded as Waikiki Beach, and it looks beautiful here, guys. A bunch of people snorkeling, and the waters look crystal clear blue, so we're about to chill right here on the beach and enjoy the views. Guys, got the palm trees in the back. This is paradise right here, Lanakai Beach. All right, y'all, so we're at a scenic point on the side of this windy road right here next to the Halona Blow Point. The Halona Blow Hole. <laughs> the Halona Blow Hole. The sun's actually out today, so we can see the beautiful blue skies and waves. But look at this, y'all. This looks crazy. So driving around this scenic area, we found another destination. This is like a little cove next to the Halona blowhole right here. So there's a couple people um, on the beach laying out and swimming, but it looks kind of sketchy. The waves look really strong blowing against those rocks. So maybe gonna take a couple flicks. Probably not gonna go in the water, but it's a really dope scenic area. So let's go check it out. Guys, the waves are so strong hitting against these walls. that I thought it was raining, but it's actually the mist from all the water blowing on these rocks. That's crazy. So we're in our next destination, the Sunset Beach, a beach on the North Shore, right on the side of the freeway. But we came here for the iconic Crooked Palm to take a nice selfie with. But yeah, guys, nice blue waters here in Oahu. I'm actually very surprised. I didn't know that Oahu had this beautiful water. But if you drive around the island, you can find some of the best beaches. Look at this. You like it. good so this is one of the main reasons why people come to this sunset beach for this photo op right here this is called a crooked palm it's just a really crazy crooked palm tree so we just took a bunch of pictures here at sunset beach and now we're about to go get excited bowls it looks like the perfect tree for a corona commercial live mas hang loose Guys, we just saw the coolest thing ever. So you have to get really lucky to see a sea turtle. And these are one of the coves that had the sea turtles. We went to Colina Cove, had no luck. We were kind of down in the dumps, but we came here to Paradise Cove right? and we saw a turtle. It was crazy. One of the best Hawaiian experiences so far. Did you like the turtle? I did. We were manifesting him. We're yeah. like, we're gonna see a turtle. We're gonna see a turtle. And we did. Yeah, it was really cool. We were just standing and then we saw like a big rock move next to our feet and we were like, rocks don't move. And it was a Hawaiian green sea turtle. That's crazy. Don't go too close, but yeah. they're cute. Yeah, they're protected by Hawaiian state federal law. So just make sure you don't annoy them too much.
Alright, good morning DBW fam. This is our last full day in Oahu. So we thought to make a count. We booked an excursion to the only sandbar or the nicest sandbar in Oahu. So we're gonna get on a little catamaran boat. Uh, we're on a little dock right now called the Heakea Boat Harbor. So yeah, about to go to the sandbar. So stay tuned. It's about to be a vibe. Let's go. Alright, this is the digs of our tour guys. We're on the morning tour right now. It was $99 but yeah, we're just in this big catamaran. It kind of looks like a restaurant on a boat. There's a bunch of tables. So if you guys come here for the later one, they actually serve you lunch. But we just got some donuts here and they were delicious. So yeah, we're just at this table and they play live music for you while you get to the sandbar. It's probably about a 30 minute ride to the sandbar. So yeah guys, let's enjoy the vibe and cue! Don't treat me like a puppet on a street. Sandbar is right there, but it's underneath the water. We're just waiting for it to rise. All right, guys. So we're on this little floating deck. You guys can hear in the background those are like fighter jets uh, flying in the air. I don't know. There's some like show going on, I guess. But yeah, guys, we're in the middle of the sandbar right now. The sandbar hasn't fully risen, so we're just like walking around waist deep on the sandbar. But it's really beautiful. Hope the sun comes out any minute now because it's kind of cloudy. This is Hawaii weather. Sometimes the sun is out. Sometimes it's covered in clouds and raining. But at least it's not raining right now. There's a lot of activities to do. Maybe we'll go kayaking and paddle boarding. They also have a banana boat ride too, but that's extra. So, hey guys, hopefully we see some sea turtles. Yeah, we're on the sandbar right now. Paddle boarding. Hopefully we don't fall. This is Leia's first time paddle boarding. Comment down below how she's doing right now. Should I wiggle the board? No, stop. I'll wiggle right now. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Okay, okay, okay. This is really hard. Larry just flipped us over. Oh, that was actually kind of cool. It was refreshing. But you hurt my butt though. Ow. How, how's it? Good. I'm paddling us. Good job. Make sure that we get straight to it. Good job. Again, lessons from the OG right here. Woo! Guns out, buns out. Or guns out. I was about to bring my phone out here because I thought we wouldn't fall but we fell like five times so good thing I brought my GoPro not my phone <laughs> we fell again it's literally perfect timing right after we got out of the sandbar it started pouring rain guys it's Hawaii weather for you Anybody else? look at this but we're back on the boat and we're gonna be riding back it is storming right now. Happy birthday, brother Jesse. Guys, so we're at Kaimana Beach. There is a Hawaiian nursing and resting area here. 
apparently that pup right there was just born last night, if you guys can see. Oh, hey. Right over there. And then this one is just a female monk cell, just chilling on her back, living the life here in Kamana Beach. Knock on wood so we don't jinx it, but I think we found the perfect day and place to finally watch the famous Waikiki sunset. We're at Kaimana Beach right now. The past two days that we've been here, it has been pretty gloomy and rainy when the sun is about to set, a lot of clouds. We couldn't see the sunset, but we are looking straight at the sun right now in about 20 minutes, the sun should go down. And guys, we brought some Bam Masubis to hold us down at the beach from 7-Eleven right here. 7-Eleven got the bangers for Spam Masubis. So the main thing about these also is that these are only 169, so it's a budget. We call this budgety. Let's try this. This is a teriyaki Spam Masubi. Mm. Wow. That's piping hot. Stays nice and fresh. Sometimes at regular 7-Eleven you get taquitos or hot dogs. They're like stale. Super fresh and nice teriyaki glaze. Spam on top. It's a great cheap snack to get. See anywhere because there's 7-Elevens anywhere on this island. Honestly, this is a pretty good beach snack. Mm -hmm. It has rice, a seaweed, and then like a Spam meat on the top. It's pretty salty. Did but you good. expect this from 7-Eleven? I, oh, I think I've only had one Spam Masubi one time and it was pretty good and this is comparable so. Mm -hmm. I used to just think 7-Eleven serves like crappy stale food at the front but these Spam Masubis are no joke for $1.50 almost. Great steal. This is the famous Waikiki sunset y'all. This is another beach we stumble upon. It looks like a very local beach. Kind of hard to get here. It's called the White Plains Beach. There's a bunch of surfers over there, so we're just gonna chill out and watch a bunch of people surf. driving along the coast of Oahu to get back to our hotel in Waikiki and we stopped along the side of the road to take in these views. There's numerous areas for photo ops but this area in particular is called Shark's Cove so there's a bunch of people down there snorkeling. So that's gonna be us next. We might come back here and snorkel ourselves but we left our gear back home so we gotta grab that. I hope y'all enjoyed this video of some of the top beaches we visited during our time in Hawaii, Oahu. So yeah, if you guys like this video, please like it, comment down below some other beaches we might have missed, and subscribe for more DBW vlogs. Goodbye Waikiki, mahalo for everything. Of course, it's gonna be the sunniest on our day that we're leaving, but yeah guys, deuces Hawaii. Thank you.